Welcome back to more new mystery the emblems. So last time we did Wind and Thunder the first DLC episode. Um Yeah, that was a strange map because yeah, we had a very strange alliance between Merrick and Michaelis going on, but yeah. It was a pretty simple map. The next two maps I feel like are gonna be a lot harder. This one in particular actually is giving me a bit of issues, but yeah. We'll get into that when we get into that. So yeah, we're doing assassins. Now the second episode. I didn't want to say this off the last video, uh, considering it is the second episode, I want to go in order and stuff, so yeah. Not long after the War of Shadows, the world slowly started to regain stability in the wake of Medius's destruction. However, the dark powers that Marth banished to the abyss began to rise once more in corners of the sea. And yeah, here we go. So, yeah, we're actually playing as the Assassins this time around, which is actually pretty cool. And yeah, I probably should talk about why I find that so cool, so yeah. Once, yeah, things calm down, man, because this is a pretty intense one, actually. The suicide the vicious bandits once feared as the demons of Samsung Mountains. Apparently, most of them are vanquished by Prince Far from the War of Shadows. However, we have reports that the survivors of Surf are hiding out in this forest and expanding their influence. They've been caught raiding villages, kidnapping women and children. They're just as evil as before. <sighs> it's not like I care what they get up to. Lady Aramai's orders is to kill every lost one, right? Yes, every last one. The suicide committed far too many crimes. If you kill them, they'll only have to suffer by their hands again. Why should we care though? It's only natural that the weak should suffer. Rora, are you gonna help us? Wee! <laughs> if I'm not glad I find that I'm fine too. Me too. Me too too. Alright, then let the operation begin. Wait, I'm not letting you take the lead. Alright, Rora, let's go. Must have filled the air order. So we got an interesting squad here. It's very um strange. <laughs> we got Katarina, she's the main character. So she dies at the game over. She's one of your strongest units though, so that's good. Um she's able to do lots of damage. She one rounds the bandits here. Or the barbarians. And she can one shot this guy, but as you see there, he rolled a little bit more HP. So yeah, we're gonna have to probably kill this guy instead. But anyway. Yeah, like I said, I like her. She can also heal too. You, know, you already know that I like her, so... <laughs> She's pretty nice, like I said. Then we got Klein, who is um, pretty good, actually. She has a good... Um, she has a good player phase, obviously, because yeah, she has a silver bow and pretty decent stats, so yeah. She has total defense too, so... She sometimes doesn't get targeted. She got targeted last time and died to a critical, but yeah, you know. <laughs> that, that happens, so yeah. Um, because, yeah, I assume it's because she can't counter and she has the crit rate on her, so yeah, that's why enemies like to go for her, so yeah, you want to be a little careful with her. You probably are safer with blocking with the Roros, I guess, but yeah. She does have growth rates, but they're quite bad, actually. She has 40 HP, 10 strength, 0 magic, 20 skill, 30 speed, 0 luck, 10 defense, and 0 res. Then we got the Roros. So this is the real one, I think, because he's the only one that has a different inventory. He has an Amor Axe, which is new to us. It's a weapon you get from House Everyone. 10 might, 80 hits, 0 crit, 1 range, and it can be used to restore HP, kind of like a Blood Axe. So that's pretty cool. The others have Steel Axes, Hand Axes, and Blood Axe. Very simple stuff. And you all have the same stats and growth rates. Which are um, 10 HP, 30 strength, 0 magic, 15 skill, 30 speed, 0 luck, 0 defense, and 0 res. Yeah, they're not very good either. And yeah, that's really it. So yeah, let's see if we can get this map done now. So yeah, here's what here's what you need to know. So these guys over here, they start moving immediately. And this is the main problem with this map. Because yeah, these guys pincer you. So what you want to do is you want to basically get away from these guys, or you could go for them. Want, but considering that this map is very symmetrical, you can go either way. I mean, not really, because there's a thief here instead. You can't stop close to these guys, so yeah, I assume yeah, you want to go for them instead. So, here's our plan. So, I think first off, I'm actually going to do this. You fill fury think you can survive against me? So, see how um, Clarice does? Yeah, she does pretty good. So yeah, now I can try killing her with the hand axe, maybe. Then I'm going to do this. With the, um, elf, right? Oh, nice crap. <laughs> nice one. Um, nice one from Katarina. Oh, 
do so. I'm gonna try the Immortal Axe actually, I'm gonna go here and do it I think, because it's the best accuracy. Weehee, last fight, fight, fight! I said one more fight, but oh well. Okay, we can kill, that's good. Now the problem with this up is, your Auroras don't have very good hit rates. With their zero luck and ten skill, yeah, they're gonna be missing a lot. That's just how it goes, so yeah. But yeah, what we can do here is, they can attack this guy, obviously. They can crit, which is nice, but yeah, of course, don't rely on that too much. <laughs> now we can do this, to this guy, hopefully. Yeah, even with true hit, um, but yeah, the higher number means that a little bit higher accuracy. Yeah, this guy, who will he go for? You'd think it would be Klein, because Klein has bad defense. Well, not bad defense. She can't, she can't counter. So yeah, I guess we'll find out. The, uh, we could also, um, but yeah, the thief is the one we could reach there. So yeah, I might actually be in the thief actually. We'll see. Because yeah, I can go here. I can go here. I think. We'll stay in the forest. Of course, you probably want to take me to that. But yeah, this one did actually go for Aurora because they have less defense. And yeah, like I said, the AI does like to go for you to less defense. Yeah. Let's see. But yeah, he does a cross, which is good. But I see that the accuracy is pretty bad. But we weakened them a lot, so that's good. He's in a forester, which is the issue. And yeah, we got a lot of enemies running towards us. But we got some help, actually, surprisingly enough. So this is the hideout of the bad men who kidnapped the V-Bonds. We will not forget selfish creatures who make people suffer. We will rescue the V-Bonds. It's what anyone will do. So we get Athena. So Athena's kind of random on this side, actually. She has a very weird inventory with a Silver Sword, a Wu Dao, a Vulnery, a Strength Potion, and a Defense Potion. And yeah, she can help you, but just be careful. If you don't use the defense potion, she has the lowest defense. So she's the one who's gonna get targeted, and she doesn't want to rejeeve us, so yeah, these hunters and stuff are gonna be a problem. But yeah, one thing we could do, we could do this. It's actually not bad to be honest. Because yeah, these mages do 14, do 7, okay. So it should be fine, I think. Especially if we're going on for us, yeah. But yeah, we can't really reach the boss, so yeah. Probably the best thing to do then is go here. The other enemies on this map, they are much higher up, so yeah. This is the difficult turn. If you can get past this turn, you're kind of in the clear, but yeah, we'll see about that. <laughs> um, so this guy's annoying because he's in a forest, and yeah, my legions don't like it when they go in the forest, so yeah. But, there we go, we killed that guy, so that's nice. So, yeah, what do we do now? So, we could go with that. Yeah, we got my Morlax one. I'll try this actually. I'm gonna be a little bit more aggressive, I think. But yeah, that didn't work. <laughs> uh, dear. Um, but you can also do this. Yeah, sure. But we do hit, so that's good. But the problem is, I'm not equipping a 1 2 range, which could be an issue. Um, I'll try this, I think. I can heal this guy too if I really want to, so yeah. But yeah, of course, I might. I am basically, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to kill as many enemies as I can on this turn, so yeah. Now the good thing is, is that um, we can do this. We can one round these dudes, but yeah. We can actually one-shot the thieves, so yeah, you know what, I'm gonna do that. So there we go, we kill a thief. Um, what's that roar gonna do, I wonder? This one here. Because you can't really kill anything. I don't think you can kill a mage. No. So... I can... I can maybe trade a hand axe around? Oh, no. You can try killing this guy, actually. So with the low accuracy. But yeah, my idea... Okay, that actually worked out, so there we go. <laughs> Now I'm gonna use um, Clarice, I think. I'm gonna use her against this one, I think. So, there we go. Again, I don't know if this is gonna work, because again, I'm playing very risky, so yeah. 
Um, let's see. Yeah, you can't kill, so what I'm gonna do instead is I'm going to probably equip the blue dial, because why not? She can't kill anyway. I'll use a defense potion. But yeah, let's um talk to Karina actually, because she can talk to Karina Clarice, yeah. You are Athena, we are Athena, we came to save the v bots Athena, you say, the Myrmidon had fallen alongside Prince Arthur in the previous one. What? Have you met before? I know, this is the first time. Miss Athena, you should stand back rather than force yourself. You can handle the rest. So yeah, let's use a defense potion then. And let's hope for the best. I think that Legion's gonna die, but we'll see. Oh, he dodged, very nice. So there we go. I probably should use the Vulnerable with him, but that's okay. So this one attacks him. And this one attacks this one. And what about that last one? Goes for this one, alright. And we don't get crits, that's good. But this one is basically out of action. But luckily we only have four enemies left, so that's good. So, yeah, we actually survived one more turn than normal, so that's good. Um, so this one also he can hand axe around a little bit, so yeah, I could also do that. So yeah, my mortal axe one. He can't one shot, so yeah. What do we want to do against the mages then? Um, because yeah, we can kill the hunter pretty easily, we can kill this guy pretty easily too. I guess Katarina might be our best bet for the mages. Because yeah, she doesn't suffer crit either, so yeah, that's good. And Klein almost one shot. And yeah, even if she gets crit, she doesn't die, so yeah, I guess we're gonna do that then. <laughs> so yeah, let's do it. So yeah, there we go, yeah, she got crit by a mage in my last attempt, so yeah, and that ended the thing, so that was pretty unfortunate for you. So anyway, um, yeah, like I said, you can use Katarina to kill another, um, mage for us. She doesn't have any ball raise though, so yeah, if she does take damage, it's a bit bad. So yeah, I guess we need to be a little careful of that. And we kill that quite good, so yeah. So yeah, I think what we're gonna do is, we're gonna do this, because it's a one shot now. We will not forgive the wicked. And yeah, I'm gonna use the shrimp push on her too, I think. I could also use on Clarice, actually. That's not a bad either. Um, then we have to bring in these enemies, but the problem is again. Um, getting crit, obviously. So yeah. Can't they in this guy with Athena though, so that's pretty cool. Because she has the weapon triangle launcher, so yeah. So yeah, I'm gonna eat. I'm actually gonna do this. See so, yeah, if we can do that. But of course, yeah. Probably the smart way to play this map is yeah, you want to um Um yeah, I'm gonna use the Bullax. I guess I think it heals more actually. Yeah, it does say so, yeah, there we go. Um it heals 20 HP, so yeah, that's very nice. Um, so I'll use a Steel Axe to kill this guy, hopefully. And then, yeah, we're gonna make our way over to the next group of enemies. Because, yeah, we wanna take these a little bit carefully. If we wanna keep everyone alive, so yeah. So, yeah, let's, um, do that. Because, yeah, these enemies... Okay, they're moving. All of them, so yeah. Not all of them. These guys haven't actually moved yet, so yeah. Let's, um, focus on these guys instead, so yeah. Um, I'm gonna kill Thief. The, uh, I guess Clarice, or not Clarice. Um, my best bet is gonna be, um, Katarina, because yeah, Katarina can go in here, which is nice. But, yeah, I'll probably borrow Wolverine from this one. <laughs> I'm actually gonna do that, I think. But he can also get attacked, which is annoying. But, yeah, what I'll do is, I'll do this. I'll go for a Wolverine. And then, yeah, you can get, <laughs> the real Legion can get some more axe back. You can also use them too. Actually, probably can't. Oh, he's full up, that's fine. I was just thinking of this guy. <laughs> uh, very, I guess it's a very easy thing to do, see so, yeah. So yeah, that's the, the range of the barbarians. So yeah, that's why I want to go with Maria. I'm going to use a Warnery to be on the very safe side. Because, yeah, let's see. Unfortunately, it's a 23 health one, which means it's not a one shot. As I probably should check that, but that's okay. You can use a vulnerability with this one. 
Um, Athena can use a strength potion. But yeah, another thing I can do is I can put Athena here though. Because you have an arm range of like... I don't think I'm, I don't think I'm in range of that yet. She's actually in range of the fire dude, but she'll be fine. She only takes five, so that's okay. Let's get our other dudes into place here. The only problem is, I'm also worried about these guys, but there's only four of them, so I'm gonna hope that doesn't go too bad. But yeah, we need to be careful of something else too. That's where the reinforcements spawn. Yeah, there's reinforcements. So, yeah. They spawn after you cross the red line, which, yeah, I need to show that. Where that is. It's near where the last bit of the is. But yeah, he apparently dodged, so yeah. I was looking at. I have my maps here. Yeah. Okay, the thief goes for Athena, which I'm good with. Athena could probably go with it. But yeah, oh, these guys are moving too, so yeah. Everyone's moving. Which I don't like, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, this app doesn't play around, does it? Anyway. So yeah, what I'm gonna do is I'm probably gonna. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do kill this guy. And I'll talk to Henry as well. Klein, are you safe? Of course I am. You can be annoying sometimes. Why do you always dangle after me? That's because I'm your big sister. That crap again? You're really bugging me. Don't say that crap again. Not until you've killed much more people than me. Oh, Klein. So anyway, let's kill this guy. Yeah, that's interesting. <laughs> now she said that, but anyway. I'm gonna kill this guy. But yeah, where's the next group of enemies that come towards us? So yeah, apparently they're here. They can be in the major Katarina, I think, so I'm probably gonna do that. I think that's what I should do. So yeah, can you do that? Maybe yeah, we can do that. But if I kill this guy from here, I'll be in range of the hunter, so I don't want that. So I think of or yeah, Fina's gonna kill. I mean she can also go for the leader. So we can do that. Are we gonna take damage? No, good. So then I can use Katarina to kill this guy and I can stay out of range of the which is good. Are we in range of a thief? No, we're only in range of the so that's good. So yeah, we just need to clear up path with our legion. So yeah. Uh not the most reliable units in the world, but they'll have to do it, I guess. So we do have a lot of them, so yeah. <laughs> that missed. That well this must. Yup. <laughs> I feel like just early game bandit just throwing hand axes like they're useless or something. Yeah, that didn't work. I do have this guy though. So I'm gonna try <laughs> That was enough though, so that's good. And I have one more legion though. Yeah, this guy, yeah, I probably should use the Steel Axe. He can die though, which is very annoying. If he misses. But he didn't, so that's good. We're getting some luck here and there, so that's good. Yeah, this map does feel a little bit orangey to play, which is annoying. But yeah, uh, not enough for, for, for this guy. That's okay. So yeah, we'll just get him next time. But yeah, this is a one shot, so that's good. From this range. Now we can take on that next group of enemies, hopefully, so yeah. I'm actually very close to where the reinforcements are going to spawn, but yeah. Now here's the problem, yeah. They are kind of merging together now, so yeah. Which, yeah, I don't appreciate, so yeah. <laughs> we can't one shot, unfortunately. Let's... How do you do? Okay. So, yeah. Do I dare do this? I wonder. Yeah, I guess I'm not these guys too. No, we want that. Yeah, we want we want the enrich of those, that's good. Yeah, I'll go for the wound out. I'll try it. Didn't work. Oh well. But we dodged again, so that's good. I might be able to kill this guy with not cut so that's cool. Yeah, I think yeah. I kinda don't wanna be in range of that guy, but yeah, we'll, we probably have to, see so yeah. Uh, what to do? I can't really use this guy, but I can try using my wall axe, dude. Um, I'll try this. There we go, it worked. <laughs> I can rely on this one at least, so that's good. He gets a level up. Yeah, that's to be expected on this map, but yeah. Um, to do about this guy. 
I assume, yeah, this is probably... Yeah, I think that's our best bet. I don't like it though, because the crit shots are so yeah. Because yeah, you can't reach the um, Bob, it has to be Katarina for that, so yeah. Unless I actually do use a Legion for it, which I probably should. But again, yeah, they also don't, they don't have the best um, time either. Uh, yeah. No matter what I do, I think I'm risking something, so yeah. That's just the way it is, I guess. Um, yeah, I think, yeah, this is the least risky thing to do, I think. But yeah, I don't like that crap. But we don't get a sense good. <laughs> we dodge even, so yeah, even better. And we also get a crit too. So there we go. So now Katarina can go ahead and kill this guy. Hopefully. It is 82 hits, so yeah, it could obviously be this. I missed 3 85s and 4 hits, so yeah, that was pretty fun. <laughs> Does sound like I'm whining about RNG, but oh well. Um, it is one of those, but anyway. Um, I'm gonna probably... Do I borrow a Walnut? I probably should. From like one of these ninja dudes, but yeah, I'll probably do this. Then I'll borrow that. But yeah, not really being able to talk about why I feel about the set too, but yeah, I guess it's interesting. But yeah, it's a little bit annoying though, because yeah, they put you in a really rough spot without a strong gear like Achilles to help you out, so yeah. I think we're getting very close to it now. Um, reinforces so nice, but anyway. It goes for, um, the hunter goes for Katarina, which we do yeah, does Katarina double? Yeah, she does. That's good. You can always sort of like her on this set, so that's nice. So we got level up. More speed's very nice. Okay, so yeah, we only have this. So, but yeah, we need to be careful because I don't want to be in range of those heroes. And we're very... I think here is where that reinforces it. So yeah. And this mage can go like around. Yeah. But yeah, we can try killing him. But yeah, we need to be careful though. Like I can go here. That's not in range of this guy. So yeah, you know what I'm going to do this. We're actually almost out of the elf fire, which is kind of funny, but yeah. <laughs> because I've been relying on them so much, so yeah. But of course, after it breaks, we can use the, uh... We can use the men stuff, so yeah. We're gonna kill that guy. Which is nice. Now we got these enemies left, but yeah, we might be able to deal with them a little bit easier. But yeah, I don't like this guy, though, but I think... Athena's fine against him, but I can go with him. Um, I don't remember the thief will do that. I can use the Vulnerary so yeah, that's nice. Let's go talk to Clarice. <laughs> with um, Athena. What the hell's with you? Why have you come here? We, ha we came to see the V-Bots, you two? Oh well, I suppose you can put it that way. Explain it properly, it'd be a pain. Very well. We then cut on this woman on your- Then cut this woman on your side. <sighs> I think it'd be easier to just kill them. Oh, cuz as long as you don't get in the way, you can do whatever pleases you. So you can use a wall. I have a I have the wood up there again, she got to this guy, so yeah. Um So I'll just yeah, this will work. I can also use a wall here as well. Alright, so yeah, you do get a lot of vulnerabilities. You probably should use them. Um a lot, so yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's have the dust. So yeah, we get hit there, that's okay. Unfortunately, the Wudao isn't doing what's well advertised, but oh well. It would be nice, but yeah, that's what it is. So yeah, we can probably do this, I think. I'm gonna do this. We'll kill that guy. We're down Katarina, because that's who she can really reach. Yeah, only five uses left, so yeah, we kind of have to be like, you knew this. And then, yeah, after that we can spawn in the reinforcements. I think the best way to deal with them is to go on the very edges of the map. Because then, yeah, 
There's this reinforce that come from here and reinforce that come from the start of the map, but yeah, then we can deal with them a lot easier, so that's good. But the heroes might start moving, which I don't like, so yeah, <laughs> they're quite scary. So yeah. But yeah, we could kill this guy now, actually. Possibly. Um, I probably should try it at least. See, so yeah, I'll go for that dunks. And it missed. Because of course. Uh, <laughs> We'll go for another one. This one here. <laughs> Let's go for another one. And that hit. So I think we can kill it now, so that's good. With the silver sword. Unfortunately, we'll do that part. Okay, we'll kill that guy. And then, yeah, we're going to be thinking about those reinforcements. And I feel like it's level up too, which is nice because she's decently useful on this map. Um, so yeah, I think the next time I'm gonna spawn the reinforcements here, let's go this way. Like I said, I think if we go um, here basically, we'll be more safe. So, yeah. so I'm gonna go up here. <laughs> because yeah, the rainbow's not ambushed, so yeah, that shouldn't be an issue. I hope. So yeah. <laughs> Um, nah, not because the ult, because I'm gonna do this instead. But yeah, I think those heroes are gonna start moving those, so yeah, that's what I'm worried about. So yeah, I guess... Uh, let's see what happens. Yeah, there's the reinforcements, basically, yeah, there's a lot of them. But luckily, yeah, they're gonna start moving towards us, but yeah, you can maybe start dealing with them a little bit. But yeah, there's a few of their shields, so yeah. Because yeah, she can bait in these two, I think. It shouldn't be too much of a problem for that. Yeah, I'm gonna use the Wudao again. Yeah, we should start killing these guys, I think. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully we have the manpower to do it. Because Kyrie is running out of tomes, which isn't great, so yeah. All our units are close to go, which is good. Yeah, 13, that's a lot. And again, we took that critical. <laughs> that would be convenient, but yeah. So there's a lot of enemies there too. And yeah, the heroes are moving, which I don't like. But look who it is. Work hard, my children. <laughs> How's it going, Eremite? Are those puppets working hard? Yes, Master Gonov. Good, I think I'll watch as well. <laughs> So we get Aramaya and Garnet, who are basically invincible on this map. Aramaya has a nose for R2. She even has Media too, because why not? Her stats are pretty good. She can eat a heal too if you give her a med stop, but yeah, that's really it. Um, and then Garnet is invincible because he has a move, so yeah. <laughs> you can't trade it though. Um, so there's that as well. It is an E rank, so yeah. yeah. Like, yeah, even that, but. I'm not trying to say, but anyway. They have the same growth rates. Um, actually, it's very generic growth rates, I'm pretty sure. It's 20 HP, 0 strength, 20 magic, 20 skill, 20 speed, 0 luck, 0 defense, 20 res. Yep. Now, the problem is, is these heroes. I bear them in, so... Oh, dear. Um, <laughs> I think we should run away. From them. So, yeah. That's probably what we're gonna do. See so, yeah. I mean, the problem is they can reach us, is the issue, so yeah. Like, I could do this, but yeah, see, that's 16 damage. That's a lot. Um, like, I could go in with Katarina, but yeah. Probably gonna, yeah, like I said, retreat a little bit. Um, this aura could go here, apparently, so yeah, I'll do that. So yeah, hmm. go down here. But yeah, of course, yeah, that's an issue. But yeah, I think these guys are just gonna die, so yeah. We'll use those for to on this one. Now, fear. But yeah, I, what I should've done, yeah, I really should've made them the um, heroes. Because then I could actually start killing them, so yeah. That's unfortunate. At least these enemies won't be an issue. And yeah, we can actually use... That's nice. <laughs> Let me teach you the meaning of the spell. 
So yeah, there we go, and there we go, he's invincible, so there's no problem there. But yeah, like I said, this is actually pretty neat, I'm not gonna lie. Using the villains. You don't really get to do that in a farm game, so yeah. Because that's kind of cool. But yeah, this, I'm very worried about. So, they're probably gonna go here. And then, Mr. Legion over here. I guess he'll go in the forest as well. And then, yeah, Katarina probably wants to go here. And use a yeah. I don't think this is gonna end well for us, but let's find out. So the hero goes for the Legion. And doubles it too, so yeah, I think this Legion's done. Or is it? Let's find out. But yeah, the other hero can't reach us, which is good. Oh, nice one, bro. Hit the hand axe, see ya. But yeah, now, yeah, these guys are being dealt with very nicely. By Eremai and Garnus, that's good. So do that. And yeah, they'll all go for Eremai if they can, because Eremai actually takes damage, so yeah. Because she has, um, <laughs> she actually takes damage, obviously. Garnus doesn't, so yeah, Garnus doesn't really get targeted. But you can obviously blow up something on the player face, which is nice. But yeah, of course, moving Eremai up is very nice because she can media something for us. And yeah, that definitely helps out a lot. So anyway. And yeah, this guy. Yeah, even if she gets crit too, because yeah, she also does have very good luck, but yeah. Um, even if she does get crit, then yeah. You can, um... Um, <laughs> yeah, what I'm trying to say. Yeah, she does get crit, then yeah, it's not too much of an issue. You've got a hand axe, you miss, but that's okay. you got kind of a wall going on there, which is kind of funny, but yeah. <laughs> Do we kill this guy, I wonder? Nah, we don't, but... I doubt there's gonna be an issue. Like, they only do fight damage anyway, so yeah. I could also get the meter to gone if I think. And maybe use that, but yeah. This I'm very worried about. See so, ya. Yeah. <laughs> what are we gonna do? So. I think this is good. So we'll hit this hero very hard. And then I think kill him like this. There we go. Yeah, why do they have heroes though? I wonder. Because they are bandits. It is kind of random, I guess, but anyway. So we should definitely try to kill this guy. I say try to, because yeah. <laughs> um, we can do pretty good here. Um, this is an issue because I killed these guys. They killed the last time, so yeah. Let's try this. So they do good though. And get a nice level up. Uh huh. Yeah, there's this guy too. I could do that. It's not a bad idea. But yeah, I get these. There's a lot going on. So yeah. I'm gonna see if I can trade the media. Because that could help out a lot actually. So yeah, we'll keep using those for our two. There we go. But yeah, I'll be very surprised I can get out this without casualty. Because yeah, so now I can do this, which is very useful. But yeah, we can actually kill the hero, so why not? And yeah, he doesn't get his scary music unless he, uh, unless he uses a boost. So that's cool, I guess. But anyway. Uh, Still don't like this one bit though, so yeah. <laughs> like if that took kills, that's nuts. But again, it is a mute, so. Yeah, this one HP, well not one HP, dude. This low HP dude, I don't think he's gonna be able to do much. <sighs> I think I think I have to go for the crit here. But is that the right guy to crit is the issue? Um <laughs> Yeah, 
is here again. We're in a pickle right but <laughs> That's a thing shot. Let's see, more axe, yeah, all my one shots. Um Yeah, I don't think we can use this guy unless I want to kill him, so yeah. <laughs> have lots of avoids, yeah, and not lots of avoids, because now this game works, yeah. I think I have to cook this. And I don't get the crit. So we take massive damage. There's the crit, of course. <laughs> That's just how it goes sometimes. Um, yeah, I'm probably gonna lose it, you know. Oh, I have this guy. <laughs> that rat. Yeah, they can crit too, obviously. But they, uh, that working is also quite bad, so <laughs> Alright, let's see what happens. With this dude. Hey, you got a crit, very nice. So Athena will die probably. Now what about say so yeah, we can't kill these enemies. But this guy is the least threatening, so yeah. So what can we do then? This guy is a bit low for my liking Banger Trippers. And it must be. What about the Amorlax? Um, I'm probably not going to use it. <laughs> again, I think we have to rely on some luck here, unfortunately. But yeah, I could also fall, but he won't. This guy won't live, I think. I have to use the Amorlax, I'm pretty sure. Hey, it could be another, like, look at this. Um, yeah, what I'll do is I'll actually hand access this dude. We could get a lucky crit. Ah, we don't. Obviously. <laughs> uh, dear. So, yeah, what do we do now is the question. Like, we probably have to retreat with this dude. Which, yeah, I think he can. So, yeah. Alright, let's see what happens. So, going for a Fina because he can kill. Okay, dodge. What about the best? So go for Aurora. Or Legion, I should be saying. Can't double. And this one goes for. Um, another Legion, so that's good. See so yeah, we're in the clip. <laughs> oh, dear me. But yeah, this guy's gonna die to Aramai. Yeah, that was very stressful. But yeah, we can win this time. Thank goodness for that. So yeah. <laughs> He also got God helping us out. So yeah, what I should do is look at the media back because yeah, she can use it here, but she can. That can help us out a lot. And then yeah, I don't think God if can reach anything, but that's okay. We got plenty of units who can finish the job here. But yeah, that yeah, that was RNG hell right there. <laughs> this map. Yeah, it's an interesting map, but yeah, like I said, I kinda wish um there was less RNG involved. Because, yeah, you get dogpiled so badly on this set. There again, I think part of the reason why I got dogpiled so badly was because um, um, I didn't bait in the hero with Athena, which I probably should have done, so yeah. There again, I guess there was a big chance for dying there as well, but yeah. So yeah, unfortunately, low HP, do you can't get some revenge, but it's okay. Yeah, like I said, playing as the villains, though, it's really cool. You don't really get to do that in Far Emblem, so yeah. And also, yeah, I kind of wish you got these dudes earlier. Like, maybe as soon as the heroes spawned. Maybe that would have made that. Or the heroes moved, I mean. That would have maybe made the map a little bit easier, or too easy, but I don't know. <laughs> That's just what I think. So, yeah. But yeah, playing as the villains, though, especially because, yeah, like I said, I do like Katarina. The rest of the assassins are super interesting, but yeah. Um, it is what it is. But yeah, this isn't too bad, because, yeah, we can do this. And then, yeah, Clarice is going to finish it also. But yeah, it does remind me of all my favorite bad endings. I'm not going to spoil the game because, yeah, that'll be late, but... Um, basically, in one of the bad endings, you basically get to play as all the bosses you fought in the game for it. And that's really cool. It 
kind of reminds me of... It's one reason why I love playing as the villain so much, basically. Yeah, this kind of does it. But yeah, I feel like you could probably take this concept and do even more cool things with it, but yeah. Let's finish this up. But yeah, getting a Fina though is very random though, but again, I guess it's part of the course of these maps, yeah. And there we go, somehow I didn't lose a unit. <laughs> but yeah, I probably sh I probably should have, but yeah. It worked out in the end because those guys went for um the Roros because the weapon triangle I'm pretty sure see so what the legions should be saying. But anyway, Klein, we've annihilated the enemy. There might be prisoners, let's search inside. Do we have to? What a pain. Hmm, what's this? They are, these are rather expensive looking paintings. It seems that stolen artworks are stored here. Jewelry, paintings, furniture? Huh. Klein? You go ahead. Alright. Me or these two are trying. <laughs> A perfect result, result I'd say. Aramai, you've raised your children well. I'm sure they'll be use they will be of use. They're worthy of being my dearest pawns. Your praise is too much, Master Garnet. However, one of the puppets has an interesting connection with the suicide subjugation. That girl doesn't know, does she? Her origins, why she lost her parents, or who pulled the strings behind it all. Indeed, she knows nothing. Heh <laughs> poor little puppet. I think that's some backstory for those two, but yeah. I'm not so sure who they're referring to, it's either one of these two, but I assume it's Katarina because the Akari's the important ones here. Klein, we've located the captives. Klein, what's wrong? You've been acting odd. I've seen this pink a long time ago. Huh? A big warm room, soft carpet, a family portrait. The two of them smiled and gently patted my head. So I actually know it is Clarice. Klein! But, but of course the... They're all... It's only natural for the weak to suffer, but... Go, run! Thank you, miss. Uh... Hmm? My name is Katarina. What's your name, miss? I... I'm called Katarina, too. The same as you. I see. I'm so happy. I have the same name as you, miss. See you later, miss. Yes, later. Katarina, please be happy. What are you doing? I'm going back, guy. Also, don't tell him all about what happened today, alright? Yes, fine. So there you go. So yeah, that was interesting. Again, kind of difficult to be honest because, yeah, a lot of RNG involved with that, but yeah. <laughs> it kind of reminds me of of Engage's DLC sometimes, but yeah. Because, yeah, the, the guest units you get are cool, but, um... They suffer, some of them suffered from terrible accuracy, and that's kind of what it felt like this, so yeah. But anyway, yeah, we've done that, so yeah, next time it's going to be the final part of the playthrough. We're going to be doing the final DLC map. Hopefully it'll be a little bit easier than that. <laughs> we'll see about that. We're going to be doing By the Sword next time, so yeah, I look forward to that, and I'll see you guys again for that.